Dad? Son, I don't have much time. What's the matter, Dad? Are you okay? Hakan, I'm all right, but our homeland is under invasion. I want you to stay calm and listen to me carefully. Traitors within the country have invaded the streets. It's a coup attempt. But this time, we're keeping everything under control. The Turkish government shall prevail this. But I need to leave the office right now. Dad? Dad? What's happening? Dad, can you hear me? It's over, Selim Karaman. We're taking over Turkey from now on. You're taking over nothing. I'm just sad that I won't be there to watch you pay for everything that you've done. We're like the Phoenix. We shall rise from our ashes again and again. Ah, see then. Dad? 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 Dad, no, please, no! <laughs> Whoever you are, I'm gonna find you. And, and I will end you. Thank you, sir. Mr. Karaman, my condolences. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Hakan, my boy. I know you are having a hard time. But you must know that your father gave his life to the service of this nation. He worked and struggled for the survival of the homeland all his life, and I see that he raised you with this consciousness. I know that you accepted this consciousness as a legacy. However, there are things that your father did not tell you. What do you mean, sir? My dear son Hakan, if you're reading this letter, I've already attained the grace of God, and I'm on his sacred path. May God grant me the honor of martyrdom. Return to Turkey without a blink, and find Barbaros Karos Manolu. He shall explain the reason of your years of training, and what I died for. My precious son, be strong, and always know that you are very dear to me. Selim Karaman. My dear Hakan, this is the center of our Moya where high technologies are developed for the survival of the Republic of Turkey and the world. What kind of technology, sir? Only very few people know this place. Here, for example, in the laboratory we've just passed, our people are working to develop and nationalize routine technologies for our industry. And in here, algorithms beyond the standards available in video and audio transfer are developed and material science researches are carried out for the infrastructure these are the investments that will take our country a step further in every sense mm -hmm. a technology called sword of the universe is being developed a technology that will bring peace and justice to humanity today as was the case in our glorious history and neutralize all known weapons. What do you mean, sir? You will understand it in time. We are very excited. We have always brought peace and justice to humanity for thousands of years. There is not any despotism and assimilation in our glorious history. Sword of the Universe has been developed not to wipe out humanity, but to provide a peaceful life to all humanity with its amazing, dissuasive power. As you also know, the world is greater than five. 
and there is only one victor. There is no victor other than God, la galibe ilallah. This makes me so proud that these studies are focused on future rather than the foreign powers in our homeland. Look, my son. The future of our country lies here. Yours too. The pioneering sources of important technologies known today are Turkish and Islamic scholars. For 600 years of our glorious Ottoman history, Turks allowed people to be free in their language, religion and lifestyle in places they had conquered. You will meet very important people soon. I know that your deceased father brought you up to have great respect for people. Consider it done, sir. You are amongst the raiders, Hakan. These raider warriors you see are the successors of a tradition inherited from father to son, lineage to lineage since the Ottomans. Let me start by introducing myself. I'm the immigrant, barbarous Kara Osmanolu, Serden Gechti, resident of the chamber. I'm Ahmed Karakecili, the Turkman Lord. I'm the Jengaver of the chamber. Financial issues of the chamber is on me. I'm Mehmet Shemi, the Circassian Lord. I'm the Dalkilic of the chamber. My duty is intelligence and weapon supply. Being an Efe comes from glory. Being Tavice comes from ancestors. I'm the outpost raider of the chamber. My expertise is electronic warfare. My regards. They call me Baran the Mad. My name is Baran and I'm the Kurd Lord. I'm the chamber's Delibashi. I'm the one you have to see when the issues about Saudis and Anatolia. Hakan, the people within this room are great men who have made great sacrifices for God Almighty and the Turkish nation. Your father was bearing the duty of Toyja, and until reaching martyrdom, he protected our land and people. Will you accept this duty and give your word to fight with all your power for the survival of this land and people? in the name of our Turkish flag, Turkish nation, and Turkish people, which was bequeathed to you from your father. I, Hakan Kahraman, hereby accept to the Toyja of the chamber and warrior of the Turkish nation and Turkish people. My boy, you will go to Cizre. We are going to accompany you as brothers, sons, and comrades in arms who are willing to be martyrs for this homeland.